Welcome back guys to another GTA 5 LS PDFR patrol on the PC. Today we're in the RT car, so this is the area car of the Met Police. Lovely vehicle by the way, I'm just going to set the time to be the actual time I'm recording on this video because I literally just forgot that as soon as I started recording, but it makes no difference, it's a few minutes behind, but yeah. Got our fire buzzards, amazing peds in here as well, we're just going to check we're available for calls. You're rolling out on patrol in this borough, we're going to be in the RT car as I said, this is the area car, so it's a Met Police pursuit unit type of thing. Hope you guys really enjoyed today's video, buckle up, it's going to be one hell of a ride. Okay, we just re reports on the radio of a robbery in progress at Rockford Hill. We're going to head there immediately. Got about just under a minute, so uh, we're just going to try and get there as quick as possible. Put the sirens on and try and arrive there, apprehend the suspects. I think you guys know this call pretty much routine uh, from my previous videos. Whoa. But yeah, I'm using the keyboard and mouse to drive in this video because uh, the gamepad is really good, but uh, when there's so much traffic on the road, you need to really sharply turn, and that's when the keyboard comes in handy. handy. In the Xbox 360 controller, there's no way I could do that. But uh, it's a lot more easier to drive, and I'm, obviously you guys you guys want to see me drive as fast as hell. And people have been complaining about my driving since the beginning I started my channel, so I decided to try and make a difference in this video. But Oh, oh, there we go, there we go. Yep, we got robbers, we got robbers. Mega Troll, Urgent, we've got a vehicle pursuit. It's got a white uh, Range Rover, I believe, on San Del Perro Road, going up to North Mad Wayne Thunder Drive. Past the residential area. Oh, just collided with another vehicle. Active message. Pursuit. Road conditions are light. Can I... I can. I can report this pursuit. Get some backup units over here as well. Yeah, pursuit initiated as of 4.56pm. Alright, pull out, pull out, pull out. Let's go. Need another unit over here. Get out of the vehicle. Stop running. The taser out. Okay, needle dick will go after the second guy. Yeah, male's running with a shirt. Stop running! Okay, in for foot pursuit, Portola Drive. We've got a male with a red t shirt, blue jeans. Uh, he's running southbound towards Spanish Avenue. Gonna need some additional backup over here. This guy is quite fast. Stop running! Still running towards the T-junction by the intersection. We've got another unit in pursuit. Stop running! Try and tackle him. He's going into the tube. He's going past the tube station. Thought he was going to go in there then. Stop running! I'm going to ask you one more time. Let's try and jump on him. Get on the ground! You stay there, okay? Hands in your head. I don't even know how these cops have got guns, but okay. Oi! Taser deployed. Yeah, Mega Troll. Male is uh, is resisting arrest, but he's now currently being detained on Patola Drive. Okay, we got the first suspect's been arrested. Okay, right. Follow my instructions. You stay there. You don't do anything funny, okay? Yeah, Mega Troll, slow the traffic down, please. We're currently, this guy is in the middle of the road. Going to cause a hazard for other drivers. Right, get over here. I officer, I don't know why this cop has a gun. I have no idea why. I disabled them in so many settings. Right, I'll mess around, okay? Right. I'm gonna go pat you down. Is there anything on you that I should know of? No? Okay, well, um, at this point in time, you've been arrested for attempted burglary and evading police arrest. You don't have to say anything, but it may harm your defense. If you fail to mention anything when questioned, something you should later run out in court. Do you understand? Let me take it to the station. Yeah, we're going to need a ped check for this uh, fellow. Apparently, there's uh, two other suspects that are outstanding, but we've got one of them apprehended. Hey All right, there. let's go get a space for our mail at San Pelo Boulevard. Investigation is pending, but the response officers are apprehended. One of these suspects, so... I think this guy's going to take him to the station. Okay, Officer Needle Dick, you come with me, okay? Yeah, make control. One suspect in custody, two suspects have escaped. To my knowledge. Okay, so this guy's going to be taken to the station. I'm just going to follow him because the other officer's going to need to, um... Yeah, he's going to need some help. This guy might try to run and break a rest. But I hope you guys enjoyed the raid video, by the way, that I put out recently. That was really fun. There's no way in hell I'm doing a shots fired call, by the way. Not as a, uh, not as a response officer. Not with what's happened to me in the episodes. It's hard enough as I'm a firearms officer, but a response officer? No way. Yeah, make control. The suspect's being taken, escorted to a vehicle. We'll be now to the situation. Not the situation. The station. <laughs> and no further assistance will be required. Over.
Right, go inside the vehicle. Got my body worn camera on just to take evidence. Thanks. Okay, that's it. That case is closed. Alright, guys, rally up. Get back to your duty. Situation's under control. We're going to need to get a team to investigate that burglary, so. To get back to my car. We're going to go attend the, um, the jewelry place where the uh, burglary was attempted. And take a statement from the person inside. And then we'll close this case up and we'll get like detectives to come later on and they'll do their own thing. But uh, I'm just going to park a car here. That's good. Alright, let's go. Let's go turn our cameras on, Needle Dick. You got your camera on? Yep. Good. Me too. Hello? Anyone here? Oh. Hello there. You okay? Hey. You alright? We're police, we're here, okay? Come with us. Don't mind just coming outside for a second, please. I can imagine this is traumatic for you, but uh, please just stay there. You're safe now. Okay, ma'am, so what's happened is we saw the burglary, we witnessed it, and we just chased the guy over there. He's been arrested now, so uh, there's two suspects at large. We'd recommend you take the day off if possible for your own safety. But I would like to take your details as well, please, um, because we're going to need them to help take a statement, so appreciate that. What's your name? What's your name, ma'am? Thank you, uh, Sophie Parker. Okay, thank you very much, Sophie. I'm gonna go check your um, dispatch. Yeah, Met Control dispatch check. Um, up on uh, Sophie Parker. Driver's license expired. We don't really care about that. All right, so um, I'm gonna call a taxi for you. Unfortunately, you won't be able to go back to work today because we now need to close this area off for an investigation because this burglary, this armed burglary, is a serious crime and it's been happening quite commonly in this area. I hope you understand. But we've called a taxi for you. And if you need witness protection or anything like that, then we'll discuss it at the station. But uh, here's the details for the station, just in case you need to you need to contact us for the uh, evidence and stuff. Just give another card. And your taxi's here, so um, ride safely. And you know where to contact our station, okay? Yeah, mate, control just made a. Oh, sorry, little dick. Just made a um, took a statement from the uh, female cashier at the uh, I believe it's the Bon Mullet jewelry store. Yeah, the armed burglary was uh, confirmed to be caught on CCTV as well. We haven't gotten identification on the males because uh, apparently they've been they had wear war face, face coverings, but we're going to need the CID team over here just to check forensics. Let's go uh, check inside here as well. Okay, so doesn't seem to be any breach of entry or anything. Can't go by here. It's locked. This restroom's locked. Okay. What do you think, Needle Dick? Case is closed. Yeah, I think it's closed. I'm gonna let the CID guys come here instead. I'd be quite cool if you got forensics to actually, you know, like do their thing. But if I had the police tape mod in, I would definitely like tape this whole place off. But obviously, you know, it's be it being it a bit annoying. Cashier till is intact. Okay. Let's go. Alright, let's go back on the beat. Come on, needle dick. I don't want to push you over, it's gonna grab you. Let's turn our cameras off, save that. Go to the station and file a report after the patrol. So that's our first incident we deal with, guys. So I hope you um, hope you find it quite insightful. Needle Dick's just staring. I don't know why he's staring. He's just standing there staring at something. But this is what we do in this today's patrol. We're in the RT car, so it's for serious crimes and like a pursuits type of thing. And make a troll show me on state two available for calls. Am I indicating the wrong way? Of course I am. Only I would do that. Let's go. Yeah, pretty pretty powerful car. I mean, I think it's an interesting thing about London, the police in London is, I know a lot of other like a lot of other forces have like tactical teams and stuff, and some forces have like firearms and traffic as the same unit. But in the Met, generally you have traffic units which are pursuit trained, but you also have RT units, and they're like response officers, but they're also pursuit trained. So a bit like I suppose you could say a bit like American cops. You know, you've got patrol cars where they can actually do stuff. Now, you won't find BMWs or Ford Focuses doing that type of stuff. It's usually cars like these, or like the Skoda Octavias, or the, um... I'm trying to remember what was the car before this. It was the very similar. It was a BMW, wasn't it? But yeah, the area cars, if you know, you know. They used to have AMPRs, Interceptor, painted on the bonnet. But I think the Mets kind of passed that level of immaturity now. So, uh, they're just kind of doing their own thing. And Manslaughter. Oh, okay. Uh, we've got attempted murder, I believe. There is a shooting. I don't know why it's called manslaughter, but we have to head there emergently. Emergently. <laughs> I was going to say immediately, and it's an emergency, but I mixed the words up because I was thinking too fast. Okay, stand by. I'm showing you on uh, responding to that uh, attempted murder. 
I think they might actually have a murder squad as well with forensics detectives inside the vehicle. I might actually change... I might actually make a mod for that, to be honest. They drive like Ford Mondeos, but they're not dog units, but they look very similar, just without the aircon. But uh, we're going to be doing pretty much what they're doing right now. We're going to head to the scene very quickly. Call a few units as well. Oh, we're dangerously low on fuel as well, so if there's a pursuit, that's not going to happen anytime soon. Um, okay, this is a crime scene. Mech control, I want these roads closed off, please. We've got a serious incident. I believe there's an attempted murder in this area. We're going to need to stop the traffic over. Yeah, okay, you just stay there, okay? You see the red lights in my vehicle? Let's put, turn the cameras on. Alright, so you see those red lights there? You can't move past this point until I tell you to, okay? Serious incident ahead. I'm not going to disclose what's happened, but uh, you have to stay there. Alright, so what's happening here? Oh, there's a body. Okay, what, what did you call 999? He did. Okay, um, Losis Jail, Losis Jail, that's very helpful. Lovely. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Okay, they're trying to find the owner's address. Oh, okay, yep. Okay, make a troll. We got a, um, we got a body, I believe. Um, condition, whether he's alive or not, is, uh, not confirmed. We need a, uh, ambulance over here immediately. I'm currently securing the area off. Can I need another backup unit as well due to the nature of the crime? Possibly an ARV over. Okay, let's go call the backup. Let's get a um, ARV over here and I want to get an ambulance immediately. I want to check for a pulse. Is he alive? Checking for a pulse. Okay, there seems to be a pulse. Seem okay, I think we can get somewhere here, guys. Got an ARV trying to come up as well. Okay, I can't seem to perform CPR, but this is urgent. We really need this guy to get medical assistance immediately, so, uh... ARV's here. Okay, guys, over here, we got a murder. An attempted murder with a firearm, I believe, and he's been shot at point-blank range, so I want you guys to secure the area off. Yeah, paramedics, paramedics, over here. Over here. We got a, we got a body over here. I'm not sure if he's alive or dead. Yeah, here we go, so this is what we're dealing with. Okay, so thank you very much for your uh, for your um, statement, but you can't stay here right now. Unfortunately, your front yard is going to be a crime scene, so I'm just going to have to put you over here. And if you want a taxi to go to your friend's house or something, it'll be fine. Oh, 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 shit, shit. Why did I do that? I pressed Control t and I pressed R instead, and I accidentally hit this poor guy. Okay, how's the paramedics? How's it going? Oh, right, well, how's it looking? Is it grim? Might as well get the I should body hope not. Bag out. Oh, okay. This sounds quite uh, morbid. They're trying to trying to like help this guy right now. I'm trying to assess his condition. You see, this officer's body cam isn't on, but Needle Dicks is. Hence, you got the red kind of ring around it. Oh, okay. Yep. Time is uh, five oh nine in the evening. I believe the male is pronounced dead on scene. Okay, we're going to need a coroner over here. This is going to be a bit more messy than I thought. We also got updated by dispatch, by the way, guys. Yeah, make a trial. We'll need a forensics over here. we got a uh, dead body on our hands at, um, I believe, the address is... What's the number of the house? Oh my gosh, this freaking, this freaking area. Okay, I'm going to leave you my coordinates instead. I think it's... Um, okay, I believe it's... 281078... Uh, South M Mo Milton Drive in Vyron Hills. I need a corner over here at this address. And a body. Okay. I'm going to help this ambulance because I know he's going to have a problem getting through so it's just move more efficiently. There you go, guys. You're welcome. Corona's coming through. Right, I'm going to move this car too. Move this guy over here because it's a bit annoying. Okay. Right. Um, the ambulance is actually <laughs> going the other way. Okay, Morgue Fairies, you do your job. Oh, the Losis Jail, but it's back, guys. I know, you missed it, right? These guys came real quick, by the way. Surprised they didn't have, like, emergency lighting or something on their vehicle. But yeah, that's a forensics uh, truck. Okay, the ambulance is there. The armed officers go back on duty, I believe, as soon as the uh, bodies took into the morgue. But this area here is going to be a crime scene for the CID. But yeah, as I was going to explain to you guys, the dispatch has updated us. Apparently we've got an address. 
of a vehicle that was used in the uh, attempted murder. So, actually, it is a murder now because the guy's dead. So, this is an actual murder case. Oh, Alright, mate. Um, yeah, I want to take. Can I take a, take, can I take your name, please, Kim, and your ID? I'm just going to take a statement from you for the situation. Oh, so, unfortunately, the person out there is in critical condition at the moment. I'm going to have to deal with it. Um, you may be called to court as well. Um, let's get a James Norman. Oh, okay. Oh, this guy's wanted. Yeah, make control. Okay. Um, so, so you're telling me you're telling me that uh, this male James Norman is wanted. Okay. Well, okay. Well, we just found a body on outside his house, and we had suspicion that there was manslaughter involved. Okay. So he might be the murderer. All right then. Okay. We're gonna make an arrest here as well. Okay. Uh, hi, James. You good? Okay. Can you just follow my instructions, please? Um, okay, so what's going to happen right now is my partner's going to come and we're going to place you under arrest, alright? Because apparently you have an outstanding warrant and you're going to be arrested on suspicion of murder for the person in your front yard. You don't have to say anything in may harm defence. He fails to mention anything you do... Um, does it fail to mention anything you do like to rely on in court? Anything you do say will be given an evidence. Do you understand? Good? Okay. Well, I'm going to take you to the... I'm going to pat you down. You got anything that can harm yourself, myself or others? It's easier if you just tell us now it's in your best interests. Search him. Nothing? Okay, he's got knuckle dusters. That's an offensive weapon. Yeah, we're taking him in. Uh, yeah, mech control. Um, I want a, a space for mail at... Um, I believe it's... In, uh, memory is so bad. The address is... 281078 uh, Byward Hills. It's on South Mendelton Drive. Oh, supervisor's here. It's actually a Parks police car, but you know, what the hell. Very nicely done, by the way. I actually do a patrol on one of these guys again sometime. Apparently some barriers are actually using these cars as incident response vehicles as well, so... You never know. Yeah, mail in custody. Um, we're going to go search on the information he's given us, but we're going to use caution because it could be a possible trap, but we're going to go to this, um, this area and now we get an investigation to be undertaken by the um, CID and stuff. We're going to go ahead to this address that we've been given a tip off for. Okay, needle dick, get in the car, fella. I do hope there's no pursuits, because if there are, then mm, we're not getting there anytime soon. Let's leave these guys to their own devices, and as the acting, as the investigating officers on the scene, we're going to head immediately to this um, incident, not incident, sorry, this uh, place that we can give a tip off for. Okay, uh, we're en route to the address. Be approximately two minutes away. Mate Control, standby. We've arrived on scene at the address of the uh, the um, alleged murderer on scene uh, at uh, Deedon Drive. Just stand by for more information. Might need some backup over here as well. Backup needed in West Vinewood. Right, let's turn the uh, radio, the um, camera on. Hello, mate. Roger. You good? We're heading over now. Yeah, I just want to speak to you for a second. Uh, let's see, Losis Jail, Losis Jail. Oh my god, this uh, script is actually rude. Okay, you're saying that this uh, vehicle belongs to you, apparently? Wait, wait, there was a car there a second ago. Where did it go? I was saying anything. Whoa! This stop running! Oh, see, so he's your friend, is he? This guy said that the person taking the car was his friend and basically told us to F off. That's what he would have said anyway. Stop! On the ground. I don't know why you were running. Okay, you're going to be placed under suspicion of attempt of uh, aiding and abetting an attempted murder. You don't have to say anything. In my home defense, he failed to question anything related to lying in court. Anything you do, still be given in evidence. Do you understand? You've also got an AMPR um, hit on this on a vehicle that this guy is owning as well, so we're going to have to go take him in. Yeah, make control. Um, space for a mail on uh, drive. Okay, I'm going to search you. You gonna cooperate with me or not? Right, I'm trying to press E to search this guy and the menu's not even coming up. This is actually pissing me off. I'll let the other officer search him instead. Okay, Needle Dick, that case is wrapped up. We're gonna let these response officers take him to the station. We're gonna go try and head to find this vehicle with the APR here. Guys, what happens here is what happens next basically is I'm gonna go and um, see if there's a gas station and fill my car up real quick. And then we'll go pounce onto that APR hit real quick as well and uh, probably call on backup. Where's the nearest petrol station? Um, 
There is one over here, but I think I'm going to go try and... I'll be a bit, bit of a hero and try and find the NPR here instead. Okay, so we've got city cameras updating the city. I've also got my own AMPR camera on the back back left of my car. If you can see the little camera hanging on the top of the roof, um, just behind the antennas, antennae, then that's what we're going to be using to track the car to, but uh, I don't need it right now because the city cameras are uh, pretty much doing the same job for me. Make a troll standby for a um, potential pursuit. We're on the address um, area of the uh, suspected vehicle. Now going to be investigating the car park that is uh, relatively nearby. I believe we have eyes on the vehicle right now. Stand by for further information. We'll turn our AMPR on, aren't we? Put the AMPR on. It's focused on the bottom left of the vehicle, so um, the rear left of the vehicle. So we'll go shine this AMPR on these cars. So turn around so the camera actually faces them. Let's have a look. This car's ticked. Nothing's come up in these cars either. So there might be an area. Yeah, no, okay. This this car park looks clean. I don't believe any cars were involved in the situation. But that's how handy this AMPR camera is. And I think that's why police cars nowadays, like especially these ones, they have AMPRs on them because you never know. It's not just traffic violations, but, you know, AMPR can be involved in very serious crimes. And it's not just traffic police that need them now. Every cop pretty much on the road needs them. So just to track cars, but as we're prioritizing this guy, if we get any hits for vehicles, we won't be taking them, we'll only be taking this specific car because this is who we're looking for, we're wanted by the police at the moment for attempted murder and you can't really get anything higher priority than that, so. By the way, I do tend to talk a lot, so if you guys already haven't already known, if you're new to my channel, then you could be figured that already. Let's go in this car park. Very peculiar, you know, fellas. Very peculiar. This car has pretty much vanished. I need to make sure that I've searched this area fully, though. Okay, we can't find it, guys. I'm really sorry. We actually can't find it, so we'll have to hand it over to the... Uh, the oh, actually, change of mind, much search this one car. Let's go for this guy over here. LD66 PUL. Nope, okay. Um, yeah, no, that's not gonna work, is it? Alright. Yeah, okay, stand down, make control. Um, the uh, AMP operation is now no longer gonna be active. This blip on the minimap is just there as a bug, really, so I just have to tolerate it. I'm gonna go fill my car up as well. I think it's this Calculating one here. Calculating route. Please okay, so we're gonna fill our car up and we'll take another route. call. Turn left. One yards. Yeah, make control. Show me out of service left. temporarily. I'm Watch just gonna be refueling my vehicle. On the left. You have arrived. Thank you very much, Siri. Okay, let's go leave this car here and go fill it up with gas. There we go. Uh, where is the container? Oh, there's a container over there. So, uh, yeah, I can't use the pumps, unfortunately, because my vehicle's got emergency lighting uh, crypt on it, so it won't really work, but it uh, should be fine otherwise. Where's the jerry can? Maybe I have a jerry can in my... Oh, I don't, do I? Oh, there it is. Oh, nope. I am not taking the heavy armored gunman call. No way. No way. Go fill up with petrol. I want to fill up full. I'll just fill up like three quarters of the way. Look, fire buzzard, there is no lanyard. I hope you're crying yourself to sleep. We've got suspect last seen in Richmond. Okay, we've got outstanding arrest warrants. Where is where are we supposed to go? Okay, um, it's this place, isn't it? I'm gonna use the GPS because the, um, yeah, the GPS is actually gonna stop. Okay, make control standby. We've got a female target. I believe her name is Rose Carter. We're gonna head there immediately. Join the freeway on the address. The left. 
go straight ahead. Idiot. Don't you dare. Go straight ahead. Turn left. What the fuck is happening? Make control standby. We Go might need a potential ahead. additional unit as well. Suspect might be armed. Where they dress now? I'm gonna go serve the warrant. Okay. Um, yeah. Stand by. Oh, oh. Be careful. You know, people are coming out. Of this neighborhood is residential. So, house on the left. You have arrived. Yeah. Stand by. Make control. We've arrived at the address, I believe. Oh, this looks a bit um, dodgy. Um, yeah. There's multiple occupants here. I might want an extra ARV over here or two. Richmond. Yeah, I believe she's connected to gang activity as well. All right. Roger. Hello there. Are you guys good? Oh, gun, 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 gun. Get back, get back. Make control, urgent, urgent. We got a uh, attack on an officer. We just got a suspect with a firearm on Rockford Drive. Needle deck, get to cover, man. Automatic weapons, automatic weapons. Oh, he's doing great for a needle dick. Whoa. Whoa. She's actually following me. Oh my gosh, I'm shitting it, guys. Oh. Come on, guys. Come on. The armed police are here. Let's just take the sweat down. Please don't kill needle dick. Monster. Shots fired, shots fired. Okay, firearms officers are engaging the suspect. Suspect down, suspect down. Oh, she's not down. Good job, boys. Good job, good job. Come on. Oh, try to tase him. Oh, freaking hell. Oh, what the fudge? I'm gonna have to call CT's foes. This is turning to a bloody shootout. These guys are a lot more aggressive than your regular cops, by the way. The CTSFOs don't take crap from anyone, so I'm just saying. Okay. These guys are invincible or something. What the hell? They're supposed to be dead, man. This is a freaking shootout, guys. This is an actual crazy ass shootout. The CTSFOs are here. We've got more ARVs. Yeah, we're going to need to close the, re re the roads off as well, so. Um, I'm going to get a ballistic shield from these guys. Okay, I got a shield. CT suppose are on scene, guys. Just to show you, we've got the CT suppose counter counterterrorism officers. They're going to be neutralizing this threat. Are these guys invincible or something? Like this is stupid. Like what? Okay, I'm guessing the mod creator tried to make them invincible, but it's actually getting beyond ridiculous. Like in real life, these guys would have been down already. But like, yeah, crazy man. Did not expect this call. If I had a firearm, I would deal with these guys right away. But. Officer down. Oh, oh no, 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 no! Needle dicks down! Needle dicks down. I'm gonna try and tend to him. Stay back, guys. Firearms officers. Oh my gosh, back, back, back. Turning into literal carnage. Can I drag the body? Get back, guys! The car's gonna blow! Oh, he didn't even listen to me. Come on, guys. Oh no. Okay, urgent, urgent. We're going to need a paramedic over here. Um, a bit of a war zone though, isn't it? We'll try and provide cover and fire for them. Alright, officer. I'm going to try and tackle the gun off with a shield. Come here, come here, come here, come here. Get on the ground! Get on the ground. Drop your weapon, drop your weapon, drop your weapon. I'm going to try and hit it with a ballistic, um, not the ballistic, with the baton. Uh, down you go. Piece of crap. Oh my gosh, this is freaking carnage, guys. We need multiple ambulances over here. We also need London Fire Brigade, guys. We need freaking Fire Brigade because this is absolutely insane. And the rest warrant. Oh my gosh, this is like a literally a terrorist incident. There's so much police casualties over here. It's unreal. But these guys have all been neutralised as well. Okay, officers, this is area secure. Okay, I'm gonna go check the back. You go follow me. Let's hit the gate open. I would take the burglary call, but to be honest, entirely honest with you guys, this is enough right now. This is a crime scene. 
So we have to go deal with this. Literally, I believe four officers have been attacked significantly at the moment. And we've got another response unit too. Where the hell are the freaking... Okay, where's the actual... Where are the fire, fire engines and stuff? Why are they spawn all the way over there? Come on. Why the hell? Come on. But Jojo, man, you're an amazing scripter. You can do better than this. I don't know why these freaking units spawn in someone's garden, but okay. Here we go, guys. Okay, we're going to need a... Uh, possibly need an air ambulance as well, because there's not enough to go around. So let's go call an air ambulance. Yeah, my control might need an air ambulance over here. Uh, we got multiple casualties, including um, police officers and civilians and also suspects. Oh my gosh, guys, this is mad. I should have done a CTSFO episode in uh, this patrol, not in the other video. I know, right, this is sucks. You guys should have shot him more. Okay, these scumbags are dealt with. Okay, guys, we have London Air Ambulance. Oh, he just literally fell from the sky. Lol. They don't have rappling hooks, do they, so this happens. Oh my gosh, don't tell me this guy's actually dead now. Come on, this is the air ambulance, man. They're supposed to do better than that. Oh, good, they're alive. Well, look, guys, the air ambulance are here. They're going to be um, tending to these officers. This guy's okay, actually, which I'm really happy about. But yeah, air ambulance is lingering in the area, as you can see, which is amazing. Bit of a bit of a, bit of a scene, really, isn't isn't it, people? A bit of a bit of a bit of a mess, as you could say. Yes, it's absolute carnage, just saying. Absolute carnage. Okay, these guys are going to be flying them away to the hospital. We get another ambulance here. We've got two ambulances. Got an ROV. Oh, we got a lot of dead bodies in our hands, people. And London Fire Brigade here, too. Richmond. Okay, so we got multiple paramedics. I have to call corners now as well because this is uh, literally a carnage. But uh, let's call corner units. Assistance required in, uh, okay, guys, what's happening here? Is this guy alright? Good. Excellent work. You're going to be flown to the hospital as well, so I'm going to fly him away. Get him a stretcher. That's what I love about Stop Ped. Such a good mod. Watch this. If it loads up. Yeah, there we go. So this is, this is amazing, man. I love the little attention to detail. It's absolutely stunning. Turn around, man. Turn around now. Turn around and run. Take your dog with you. Loves this jail. Oh my gosh. Okay. This is crazy. It's absolute, absolute carnage. I'm gonna be very careful with this arrest warrant. Um, call out from now on because they can turn into something absolutely chaotic. Steady on, boys. The air ambulance is trying to fly as many people to the hospital as possible because the ambulances locally at the moment are just overwhelmed. And uh, the coroners are trying to do their own thing. The uh, forensic services. You've got more bodies over here, they need more treatment as well. Yeah, mate, control. I think we're going to need another ambulance over here, mate, because um, we've got uh, multiple casualties and there's not enough paramedics to go around. Call another ambulance. We've still got these guys over here as well. Dead. Dead, dead. Alright, is that ambulance spawned in someone's garden again? I swear, if they do, I'm gonna get mad. Oh, there we go, that's good. Guys, I'm, I'm, I'm sorry, but that's enough at one day. Like, that's this patrol done. That's already shook me up. <laughs> the whole call out was crazy, so I'm gonna call it a day for today's patrol, but uh, I've really enjoyed it. We'll try and make this crime scene go as smooth as possible before we end the video but thank you very much in advance for watching the video don't forget to like share comment subscribe i will see you guys soon in another episode with this mess that these guys are carrying out power medics over here you got bodies go treat them for me please okay oh my gosh one of them is burnt as well that was an ambush but it's good all the terrorists got killed so you know that's that's what matters i guess but yeah Okay, that, that was that was a patrol on the half. I mean, it's actually been 20 minutes. I'm looking at the clock on the bottom left of the screen. I can also use my body cam as a clock, top right. And yeah, it's been about a good 30, 20, 30 minutes to done this video, hasn't it? So I guess I can finish now, but yeah. 
Okay, adios guys, thank you very much for watching. I will see you guys soon until another episode. Stay tuned.